This is a 10 minute prayer against spiritual spouses. Many of you are having sexual dreams. You're waking up with bruises and scratches over your body. You're feeling these encounters physically. You're waking up and you're noticing human release over your body. You're having all of these wet dream, all of these demonic encounters. But it shall end with this prayer in the name of Jesus. Father, I pray for your people now, God, that you will set them free from every diabolical encounter, Father God, that comes from a spiritual spouse, that comes from incubus and succubus in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, I pray, Father God, that every evil power that is within your people, it will leave now in Jesus' name. I command incubus, I command succubus to leave God's people now in the name of Jesus. Maranta da basonto. Ricanta da ban sova aika masondo, ricanta da ban sovre ika, maranta da ban sove inka, maronto do bo seve, ricanta da baso. Lo, we decree and declare a divorce in the realm of the spirit in the name of Jesus Christ. However, these spirits have found expression, Father God. We break the foundation. We break the covenant in the name of Jesus, Lord. Every evil dedication, Father God, we destroy it, Father God. However your people may have been sacrificed or initiated, God, I break it at the root now in the name of Jesus. Lord, whoever they fornicated with, Father God, and this is what's brought, Father God, the host of the marine kingdom, all of these spiritual spouses and demonic spirits, I break it. I command those soul ties and soul fragments to leave them now. In the name of Jesus, Ricanta da Banso, Ricanta Banso Veki, Maranta da Banso, Ricante de Besuto. Whatever, Father God, these spiritual spouses have brought, whatever curses and diabolical assignments that they have brought in the night when they have merged themselves with us, Father God, we've announced it, we reject it, we break it in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh Ramasi Kerive Aika Rogondo do Boske Makailama Riganda da Basoto Robo Santam. How long, God, will we continue to have these encounters? How long, God, would your people, Lord, continue to go through these things? Arise, O God. Your word says in Psalms chapter 68, verse 1 Let God arise, let his enemies be scattered. Let those also who hate him flee before him, Father God. Cause these spiritual spouses to flee we command them to flee because we have the spiritual authority for your word says and i've given you the spiritual authority to trample over the scorpions and the snakes in the name of jesus Arise, O oh God. Let these spiritual spouses be scattered. Arise, O oh God. Let our enemies be scattered, Father God. Arise, O oh God. Robo Santa da Rokondo dobo se mahi karava rande deve sure ma aika Rokondo dobo se. Lord, there are many people that are listening to you right now, Father God, that they have had reoccurring dreams. There's frequent dreams from that, that continue, Lord, and it seems like there's no end, Father God. I pray that that cycle breaks. I pray that the cycle breaks in the name of Jesus Christ, God. For your word says in Psalm chapter 37, verse. 25. I was young and now I am old and I've never seen the righteous forsaken. God, we know that you will not forsake us. God, we know that you will not forsake your people, Father God. Arise, O God. Arise, O God. Robo Shanta Dabaso. Come on, randa da basi ke reve kanda da basoto. You feel something leaving you right now. You're feeling hot right now. You're feeling sweaty right now because something is leaving your body. These powers are leaving your body. You're coughing up right now. You're vomiting up right now. In the name of Jesus, you're yawning right now. You're shaking. It's leaving you. In the name of Jesus, oh masi ke maranta da basoto. For your word says in James chapter five verse sixteen that the prayers of the righteous are effective and powerful shata rokondo do boske randa da banso te be kabanto rokondo do boske rikanta da banto do boske rigende de beska rokondo do bo leta banto father we pray effective prayers right now 
We pray effective prayers right now. We pray powerful prayers right now because we are the righteous. We are the righteous and we lift up our voices and we decree and we declare together that every spiritual spouse must leave our bodies in the name of Jesus. Yes, yes, yes. Whatever these ent entities have stolen from you, whether it's finances, whether it's marriage, whether it's health, whatever it is, I break it. I break it. Oh, Father, I pray that you'll restore unto your people the years that these spiritual spouses have taken, that they have hijacked in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, for your word says in Psalm chapter 34, verse 19, the righteous person may have many troubles, but the Lord delivers, delivers him from them all. Father, we are going through many troubles. Deliver us, O oh God. Deliver your people. Have mercy, O oh God. Have mercy, O oh God. Cleanse your people from these immoral spirits. Cleanse your people from these impure spirits. Cleanse them, O oh God. Cleanse them, O oh God. Set them free from that covenant. Set them free from that stronghold. Oh, man de de ben soto. Mighty man of war. Arise in your people's life. Arise in their life, O oh God. Rondo do wo si kere man si. Randa da ban so kadiaba. Rokonto. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every menstrual issue that comes from spiritual spouses, I break it at the root. Every infirmity that comes from a spiritual spouse, I break it in the name of Jesus, Father God. I pray right now, I decree and I declare, Father God, that these encounters in the night will stop. That they will stop because the covenant is broken. The covenant is broken. The blood of Jesus speaketh better things than the blood of Abel. I want you all to begin to pray and renounce. Renounce any covenant that's within your bloodline. Renounce it, Lord Jesus. I renounce any evil altar that I'm, I'm attached to. Father God, I renounce the sins that I've committed that have bonded me with evil forces. Father God, I close every door I've opened to the enemy. Father, I break every legal right the enemy has over me. Anything that was done to me, any initiations, any sacrifices, God, I reject it. I renounce it in the name of Jesus. Every legal right that any spiritual spouse has over my body, I break it in the name of Jesus. Jesus Christ, I break the legal rights. Come on, pray that type of prayer right now. Pray that type of prayer right now. The cords by which you are attached to this spirit is breaking. The Lord is severing it. The Lord is severing it right now. The Bible says in Isaiah chapter 27 verse 1, In that day the Lord will punish Leviathan, the fleeing serpent, with his fierce and great and mighty sword, rescuing Israel from her enemy, even Leviathan, the twisted serpent, and he will kill the dragon who lives in the the sea every entity that lives in the sea that is bombarding your life uh, bombarding your finances bombarding your health uh, bombarding your children bombarding your mind bombarding your marriage bombarding your job i command it to break every force from the water that is stagnating your life that is delaying your life that is delaying your ministry i command it to break oh masike himakuya masuke riaka God, we stand on Psalm chapter 118, verse 5. In my distress, I prayed to the Lord, and the Lord answered me, and he set me free. In my distress, I prayed to the Lord, and the Lord answered me, and he set me free. Oh, my God, he is a God that answers by fire. Come on, cough it up. We command it to leave. We command it to leave. Whatever is still remaining, whatever, whatever is still remaining, I say leave. I say come out. I say come out. I say come out in the name of Jesus. Begin to release. Begin to release right now. Every soul tie comes out. It breaks now in the name of Jesus. Every soul fragment, it breaks now in the name of Jesus. Whatever the enemy has placed within your body, I break it in the name of Jesus. Barrenness, sickness, delay, stagnation, the spirit of death, whatever it may be, I break it 
in the name of Jesus Christ, I decree and I declare that you will no longer wake up with bruises and scratches and sexual encounters. It ends today. That evil covenant, that evil altar no longer has your name or blood on it. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I pray amen and amen.